My glass app is really unique because it lets you control uh, your glass and there's one feature that I really like and it's called screencast. What screencast does is basically it streams what you see from glass over to your mobile device. So I'm going to turn it on. So basically what you're seeing there is what I'm seeing through glass. And if my display goes off, it also goes off on your mobile device. Okay, glass, take a picture. So right there, I just took a shot and it showed up on uh, my uh, Galaxy S4. I'm going to get a quick video for you to demo how uh, accurate uh, glass is. Okay, Glass, record a video. So by default, as I stated before, the recording lasts 10 seconds. And if I wanted to extend it, tap the side, extend the video, and it goes on until you run out of battery or you run out of storage. Tap again on the side and it stops recording. And if I wanted to uh, preview the recording again, I just tap the side. Sorry about that. Uh, tap the side, slide forward. The audio streams um, to my glass only, and it doesn't go to the, the uh, mobile device though, unfortunately. So right there, that's the video I just recorded via glass or through glass. I can tap it to stop. I can share it with my groups. Or I can slide down to cancel. And if I wanted to see the picture I just took, that's it right there. Again, I can share it if I wanted to. Or I can go and delete it. That's how easy it is to take a picture. And this is some things that came up over the last uh, few days that I've searched for, taken pictures of. This is a Google News update. Hey, that's Callie Lewis. Okay, so that's it for this quick walkthrough of how uh, you take a picture or a video using glass uh, through uh, voice activation. Thanks again for watching. This is Vincent Wynn for Slash Gear.